Hey guys, welcome once again to another video review brought to you by BuyMeAnIPhone.com. I'm Omar C, and uh, today's video review is sponsored by Radius Earphones, and uh, they're going to be sponsoring a giveaway this month as well. So every single video I'm doing, probably the next six videos or so, I'll be giving away a free set of Atomic Bass, Radius Atomic Bass headphones with every video review. So watch the whole video, I'm going to tell you at the end of this video what you have to do in order to win those, okay? So the case I'm going to be showing you guys today, by popular demand, everyone has been bugging me and bugging me and mentioning that they really, really, really want me to review this case. So I'm going to be reviewing the uh, Switch Easy Rebel Rebel case. And this is the limited edition serpent, serpent skin looking case right there. Okay guys, so I'm finally going to do this review. I've had numerous people tell me about this case. And so I'm going to give you my thoughts and tell you what I think about it. So let's go to the other camera now. Okay guys, so here we have the packaging for the uh, Switch Easy Rebel Serpent Limited Edition case. I'm not going to bust this open because you guys probably already know how that works. You've seen enough reviews of that. Uh, this piece comes in here, a little box down here. And so this comes with a couple of little accessories and additions here. Oops. Excuse me. So first we have a little uh, video viewer type of little stand for your iPhone right there. If you want to watch videos using that, you can do that. It also comes with like a base. If you, I guess if you have any sound systems or speaker systems, you can use this with that as well. With the case, I suppose. It's wide enough to fit the case in there. And it comes with a tip that goes on the bottom of your uh, iPhone to plug up the connector port. So the dust and stuff doesn't get in there. And I'll put that in just a second. So here we have the case. <clears throat> Let me put this stuff out of the way. I don't have to mess with that anymore. So here's the case. And inside the case, Switch Easy was nice enough to uh, also give you a cleaning cloth and two screen protectors. Pretty nice. It's always nice when they throw that in there. And some instructions on how to snap the case together which uh, I think I've done it enough times now, so I don't need that anymore. <clears throat> so here we go, here's the case. Now basically, the Switch Easy case, or the Rebel case, is basically like a, um, like a, it's almost like a hard plastic case on the inside, but it's flexible. It has like a, it's like a jelly, there's like a jelly, silicone-ish, I don't know, um, softness to it, I guess is the word I'm looking for, softness, I don't know. And it has like this spine, this plastic spine that goes on top of that. I will warn you guys if you if you take off if you like swapping your cases a lot this case is annoying to take out to take apart and to put together again. So we have this plastic spine here which is really nice, really hard, and as you can see it has that um, serpent uh, reptile skin looking texture on there which makes that's why it's a special edition case. So that's just plastic, and this is the one that's more flexible. It's not sticky like silicone. It's just plastic, but it's like a real flexible plastic, soft plastic. So let's grab the iPhone and pop it in here. I'll show you. How annoying it is to actually put on. And geez, I'm turning my phone on everything here. Okay. So you kind of snap it in place. Okay. And you make sure you line up the right one. This piece goes on top right here. So you kind of have to just play with it and snap all the pieces, the little ribbed pieces here to the sides. In the center. Just gotta work with it to get everything on there. I think that's it. Yep, there you go. <clears throat> so overall, a really cool looking case. Has a good, has a good, it's nice tight fit to it. Thanks to the uh, little ribbed section on the back. Smooth protection. If I could, I definitely feel that this, uh, the inner, the inside piece, this plastic part, adds a little bit of good shock absorption if you were to drop it. As far as accessibility, most of the things are covered up and pretty protected pretty well. Let's see if I can get a good shot of that. We have the standby switches covered up, but that, that little rubber nub right there, you can feel it click, so I, I like that. I hate when case companies put a, a cover over that and you can't actually feel the click on there, but you can actually feel it with that one. The headphone jack, eh, it's a pretty small hole, so if you have big headphones that aren't iPhone headphones, they may not fit in there. You may need to get a little adapter to get them to fit in that hole. The camera lines up real good, no problems there. The uh, mute switch, the opening's pretty good. I have big fingers, but I can still work my fingernail in there to, to work, get that to switch off for the mute. The volume up and down switch, you can also feel that kind of click whenever you're messing with that as well, even though it's protected and covered up. Let me put this on mute. There we go. <clears throat> and so here we go with the uh, dock connector, this, the microphone, and the speaker. Everything's open up right there. And then you take this little tab here and make sure I put this in right. And that basically goes in the bottom to uh, make, make sure there's no dust or anything else that gets inside there. Everything else is opened up. No, oh man, that's a lot of fingerprints. No, uh, the home button's not being covered up, and the sensors aren't being covered up either on top. The sensors are completely exposed, so no problems with that as well. 
So pretty nice, pretty nice case, I'll admit. Um, you know, I, I get a lot of, I've had a lot, a lot, a lot of requests for this case. And um, it's funny because, you know, all the reviews I do on YouTube and all the other, like Vimeo and the other, the other uh, websites, I always post those on BobbyNiPhone.com. Uh, that is except when Tom, who's also another reviewer for BobbyNiPhone.com, when he does his video reviews of the same items, depending on which one of us does it, he'll post it his on the website or I'll post it on mine and we won't do a video of it. Um, but Tom did a video review of this case a little while ago. But I've gotten so many requests to review this case that I actually went, went ahead and went out of the way and I'm doing this review for you guys. So this is just going to be on YouTube. This isn't going to even be on, on buymeaniphone.com. But um, I don't know. This case is so freaking popular. I don't, I don't understand it. It's a nice case. Don't get me wrong. But um, I don't know. There's nothing that special about it. It's, I mean, it kind of looks cool. Maybe that's one thing about it that's really nice. But besides that, it's just another snap-on case. I don't know. I don't, mean, I don't mean to be negative or anything, but I just, I guess from all the, the hoopla and the, you know, all the, um, the positive things people have been saying about it, I guess I was just expecting something more because it's been hyped up so much. But, you know, either way, it is what it is. It's a nice case, and uh, I still would recommend it. If you, this is your style of case. I'm not, I'm not going to say I don't like this case. I'm just saying I thought it would be a lot better than what it really was. So, really cool case, it looks really nice. The other versions that aren't the special edition versions, they come in different colors as well, which is really nice. You can customize and pick different colors. There's like yellow and black and red and all these different colors, so that's kind of cool as well. Definitely provides really good protection for the iPhone. Comes with a screen protector, so you'll perfect, protect the screen from scratches at least. And it's not too bad at all. So this is the Switch Easy Rebel Limited Edition Serpent Case. Okay guys, so I told you at the end of my video I would uh, explain what you have to do to get yourself in the drawing for the free atomic base headphones from Radius, earphones. So basically what we're thinking about doing is doing a live video cast from blogtv.com. So what I'm basically asking you guys is, one, would you watch a live video cast from Buy Me an iPhone? Me and Tom and the other reviewers and, and uh, editors on Buy Me an iPhone do a little show on there. Would you be interested in watching that? And if you would be interested in watching that, what would you like us to talk about and what would you like us to do? And basically, if you're not familiar with Blog TV, it's basically a live video cast. We can post the uh, the video on buymeanlife.com, and you'll basically be seeing us live, talking to you, and you can chat and uh, post your questions and talk, discuss different things on there as well. And we can also have a co-host on, and we can have two people chatting or two video feeds at the same time, where we can be talking, and discussing. So if you want to see interviews, if you want to us answering questions, we'll probably do kind of all sorts of giveaways and stuff during the video uh, video live video cast as well. Uh, so that's basically it. Just tell us if you'd be interested in seeing that. If not, that's cool. Don't worry about it. I just want your honest opinion. And if you are interested in seeing that, what would you want us to talk about and discuss on that uh, Blog TV video cast? Okay? And make sure you're a subscriber to my YouTube channel also to get yourself on the drive for this for this contest for the Atomic Bass headphones. What was that? Atomic Bass headphone, headphones for your iPhone. Okay? Thanks, guys. Another video coming up very soon.